So stay in your lane, you will slay in it. And and and, and <laughs> stay in your lane and you will slay in it. Before you watch this video, please make sure you subscribe, like the video, and press the notification button so that you do not miss another video from this channel. And people don't understand also would say amongst people with the gift. There's a lot of competition. There's a lot of, I want to be better than. There's a lot of, I want to be like. And then people end up losing focus on their gift that they were given. What advice can you give us, including people in the process of uh, Ugutwasa or who are students at university? What can we do to stop competing, to focus on our gift? Not just the, the gift of being a healer, any gift you have. Instead of looking at Coco Dineo's gift, what, what, what can we do? Please give us advice, Shem. First of all, you need to fall in love with what you are gifted with, outside what it is. Fall in love with the gift itself first, because that's very important. Understand the people you are working with, what type of ancestral spirits, because I'm not like a Mm. right understand how because they don't give you something that's going to take you away from your passion i've always loved speaking i've always loved sharing i've always loved teaching so they've only come to extend what already existed they're an expansion of what already existed because i worked as a facilitator and a consultant right but also it's very important to stay on your path eliminate things that will draw competition because the minute you are starting to see me now i don't follow sangomas because I don't want to be distracted, right? I follow people who I aspire to be as a healer. Because Sangoma is one way I heal. I heal in many mm. ways. Sangoma is just one way. And also understand, Guti, there are many ways towards a path of greatness. But there's only one way chosen for you. And if you don't invest in yourself, you are not going to be able to thrive in what has been you have been called to. A lot of healers don't want to do work on themselves because we are birthed into this calling through suffering, pain, and woundedness. So you think by twasering, you're going to heal the rape that you, you experienced as a child. You think you are going to heal the abandonment of your father. You think you are going to heal the discrimination you experienced because you were called. No, 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 no. You need to get help. You need to psychologically and emotionally be well. And in Dumba, gives you only solace when there is clarity and healing or care in the heart. Because I'm going to feel comfortable if you have discomfort inside. So mm. investing in yourself by healing your wounds is very important. Invest in your skill. We don't want to study. After Pesho, what did you do? After Pesho, I went and became a Heal Your Life teacher. I became a coach. I became other things. So I continuously invest in my practice because human beings are complex. They're continuously changing and evolving. So in order for you to understand the dynamics of 2020 of the people you are working with, if you don't invest in learning, always be a, a student to master a craft. So that's what those are my... And, 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 and trust your people. La Lela Ela Kitozi, not Liga Coco Dineo, not Ilgabani, because even when I left to Kobelawam and we didn't speak for a long time, when I came back and she said, I'm proud of you because it means you've been in honor. Once you become in honor of your people, and you cannot be honor of your people if there's too much noise. If you pegu to Coco and a woo, Sega Kuma no Tenji, well, last week was so easy, woo, Dineo Ranak, eh, Mkamba, when I yours is to go speak no Cyril Ramaphosa Parliament, you don't know. So stay in your lane, you will slay in it. And, 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 and <laughs> stay in your lane and you will slay in it. You are unique, uniquely gifted. And understand not all of us are called to be practicing healing sangomas. Those who are called to be healing practices sangomas are not called to be kobelas as well. We can't all want to be teachers. Because some of us are called to heal ourselves and mm. heal our own ancestral lineages because there are family pathologies and generational curses by accepting the call, we break them. So mm. understand the thing that you are being called to, but you can never understand it if you don't invest yourself in it. It takes time. Failure are uh, stepping stones to success. Don't be afraid to fail. Don't be afraid to make a mistake because mistakes are God's lessons paved our way. Miss the mark so you can know better because as you know better, you can do better. Also, it's, it's, it's very important. Perfection is an illusion. Understand that in the imperfections, you are crafting your mastery because this work is through experience that you know and you understand, but invest in it and it will actually bear fruit for you. So it's very important. Follow people who inspire you towards your greatness, who don't inspire you to your worst self. 
So negativity is an energy because healing doesn't begin ngamatambo, ngemiti. Everything is healing. So the kind of environment you are keeping, the kind of friendships, the circles you are part of determines your projection. Uh, Les Brown speaks about only quality people, QP. Only quality people in your life. Do not be in the company of people who are wanting to put you back to where you were. Mm. You've moved um, uh, five kilometers ahead. And it's not good to uh, 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 but there's friends that I don't keep anymore. There's conversations I'm not part of. Yeah, I understand that. Because when you are being part of gossip, you are actually blessing the other person. Because mm. the more Coco Dinawa's name is being called, the more it gets registered in the heavens. The more the blessings of the ancestors come because something is important about her. Hence, you are talking so much about her. Whatever that you're talking, because in the, in the universe, do not does not exist it's only the other word that exists so understand what you put energy into is what you are going to get at the end of the day and 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 i follow my own students who i have trained because we've got principles of 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 love and light mm. love and light and love and light does not mean perfection because each light has a shadow so as Dineo, i have my own shadows and every year i invest in healing myself i'm i invest in doing better so i can offer healing from a place of integrity also know your limitations and your inadequacies where you are not able to perform you are not a miracle worker you don't carry a magic wand you don't have the power you're a facilitator of power so the person whom you are healing is also needing to do the work in order for the healing to okay so please Please catch my TED Talk. It's on YouTube and, and, and my YouTube channel as well, where I speak about the things I'm learning as a spiritual healer. It's four spiritual lessons because I have learned tend you with this. I will put the link in the videos. I will put yes. the link the videos at the end of the stream. Please, Thank guys, you. do subscribe to Coco Dineo. There is a world of knowledge on that channel. Please do subscribe and watch. And don't forget when you watch our YouTube as South African creators, do watch the adverts because it does help us a lot. Humility point. and humbleness. I wouldn't be having the stream with you, Tenji, if I was arrogant. You DM'd me and you offered me some big advice that I've been seeking as Gutung Zoen Zenjai. That's why I'm saying know your limitations. If you don't know, you don't know. It doesn't make you an inadequate healer. It doesn't make you because you can never master everything. Jack of all trades masters none. So when yeah. you DM'd me, I I, I was like, oh, UK number. <laughs> okay, I asked for some advice. I called you, but I didn't say I won't try to have delete. Humility yeah. and humbleness. Because it means you always have to come from there. So no man figen dumbe. Nabona ngi flick gan chani ngi mood. Men figen dumbe buy. Take off my red bottom shoe. Put it on the side to us and book on a bum cool. No man naming sasa um duanetos. Nami, I still ask for the blessings. Everything that I accumulate is because they have paved it, they have brought it. I don't just think I, I can make everything work because I am coco dinero. I am Coco Dino because they are. But without them, I am nothing. Without you, Tenjiwe, without my fellow followers, without people who are giving me love and support, I understand the concept of umuntu, umuntu, abantu. And that's one thing we have lost as healers. We fail to refer people when we can't. I'm not a medium. I've got people who are Sangomas who are mediums. Now I'm a number. I'm not going to pretend to be a medium. No. Because now you're thinking people are going to be like that, you know? So when I said I don't follow healers because there's a lot of negativity on social media. And for those who are about to embark on their pro, pro, uh, uh, processes, be discerning. Have the spirit of discerning discernment desperation leads to exploitation i've had a lot of people who've been ripped off because they're following the wrong coco dinero i don't consult over whatsapp mina it's either uzong bona online or it's gonna be face to face you know and i will never you know speak to you and give you uh, things without you consulting me like this so i don't bring back lost lovers because i would have brought some exes back if i had the ability <laughs> you know i don't have lot of numbers so yeah. let's be not be just Next, yo and Mankala Ganjan, Amakunda, and Wemal Kokwe, Mfunamaku, because we don't want to put in the work, you know. We need to put in the work to get in the results because we also understand the people who get things very quickly, they go like a bandaba train. That's why everything is shabalan. So it's very important. But if you know yourself, if you do your work and you are self aware, your ability to thrive because you can have a powerful Josie, powerful Kobela, powerful healer, but if you un you don't know who this is, 
You don't know who this gift is. You don't know I am a gift to the world and I am what I am. I am God's child. And focus on what they've given you and stop seeing who's doing what wrong. Because they are trying to go back to you.